Welcome to a meditative compline for Monday, May 8th, 2023. As you prepare to listen or follow along in the Book of Offices and Services of the Order of St. Luke, start with taking a slow, deep cleansing breath to help center and ground yourself as you prepare for bed. Slowly exhaling out all the busyness of the day to help quiet your thoughts. While you continue to breathe in and it out, relax into a comfortable position. You notice in the quietness, distant sounds, lingering sense of the meals cooked throughout the day, the comforting feel of your sacred place, right here, right now. Once you are comfortable, be still, being aware of God's presence that had always been there within and around you. The sound of the meditation bowl announces the opening moment of silence. Call to prayer. O oh God, come to our assistance. O oh Lord, hasten to help us. The Holy One grant us a restful night and peace at the last. Amen. Our night hymn, Come Down, O oh Love Divine. Come down, O oh Love Divine. Seek thou this soul of mine, and visit it with thine own adored glowing. O Comforter, draw near, within my heart appear, and kindle it thy holy flame bestowing. O let it freely burn, Till earthly passions turn to dust and ashes in its heat consuming. Let resurrection light shine in my darkest night and clothe me round the while my path illuming. Confession and Assurance the most holy and beloved, our companion, our guide upon the way, our bright evening star. We repent the wrongs we have done. We have wounded your love. O oh God, heal us. We stumble in the darkness. Light of the world, transfigure us. We forget that we are your home. Spirit of God, dwell in us. Eternal Spirit, living God, in whom we live and move and have our being, all that we are, have been, and shall be is known to you, to the very secrets of our hearts and all that rises to trouble us. Living flame, burn into us. Cleansing wind, blow through us. Fountain of water, well up within us that we may love and praise in deed and in truth. Let us join in a time of reflection. We are a forgiven people. Thanks be to God. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Psalm 139, verses 11 and 12. 
If I say, surely the darkness will cover me, and the light around me turn to night. Darkness is not dark to you, the night is as bright as the day. Darkness and light to you are both alike. Glory to you, O Trinity, most holy and blessed, one God, now and forever. Amen. Our scripture reading comes from 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verses 9 through 10. NIV For God did not appoint us to suffer wrath, but to receive salvation through our Lord Jesus Christ. He died for us so that whether we are awake or asleep, we may live together with him. Holy Wisdom holy word. Thanks be to God. Colic. Day dies away, yet your light shines on in the darkness. As we pray at the ending of the day, bring our work to a close and prepare us for rest and peace at the last. Amen. The Lord's Prayer. Our Father in heaven, Hallowed be your name, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Our night hymn, God who made the earth and heaven. God who made the earth and heaven, darkness and light, who the day for toil has given for rest the night. May thy angel guards defend us, slumber sweet, thy mercy send us. Holy dreams and hopes attend us this live long night. When the constant sun returning unseals our eyes, may we born anew like morning to labor rise. Gird us for the task that calls us, let not ease and self enthrall us strong through thee whatever befall us O god most wise commendation in peace we will lie down and sleep in the lord alone we safely rest guide us waking o lord and guard us sleeping that awake we may watch with christ and asleep we may rest in peace May the divine help remain with us always and with those who are absent from us. Let us join in a moment of remembrance. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Canticle of Simeon Lord, you have set your servant free To go in peace as you have promised For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior Whom you have prepared for all the world to see a light to enlighten the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to you, O Trinity, most holy and blessed, one God, now and forever. Amen. My brothers and sisters in Christ, 
May the Holy and Blessed Trinity guard and bless us. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Book of Office and Services, The Order of St. Luke.